Welcome to the video tutorial section for EGRAF World Cultures and EGRAF Archaeology. I'm Elisa Jordan and I'll be your guide. In this video you will learn how to cite EGRAF and how to cite documents located through EGRAF. The most efficient way to find, copy, paste, or save pre-formatted citation information is by using the Cite button located throughout HRAF. You can quickly obtain a pre-formatted bibliographic citation anywhere you see the Cite button in eHRAF. The places where you will see that button include beside the author's name and document title field in the Document and Paragraph Results view, in the Full Context Page view, at the foot of the publication information page for any document, and on culture summaries in Browse Cultures. After clicking on the Cite button, select the reference style that you prefer and then copy and paste the text. You can also export the reference to your chosen citation management program by clicking on the link. When citing a document from eHRAF, if your citation allows for it, include both the original publication citation and information about where and when you found it. You should also include the date of access for any eHRAF resource to complete your bibliographic reference if the citation allows it. When using subsistence types, please acknowledge that the classification was done by HRAF staff and please refer back to eHRAF in the table title or a table note. If you use samples supported by data in eHRAF, cite those when possible. If you have used HRAF's subject indexing system in an advanced search, identify the subject description and the OCM identifier from the outline of cultural materials in the text. You may also want to include permalinks in your citation if the style guide allows it. Permalinks are permanent static hyperlinks. In eHRAF, permalinks will take you to the publication information page for a specific document. This is useful if you would like to direct someone to a resource found in eHRAF. You can find a document's permalink by clicking on the permalink button in eGraph. This button can be found at the foot of any publication information or full context page focus view page. When saving and sharing permalinks, please keep in mind that you can view publication information pages without logging in, but you cannot navigate through entire publications, view document pages or paragraphs, or conduct searches without logging in. And also keep in mind that HRAF depends largely on membership dues for support. Reference to our data stimulates interest and possible new memberships. More memberships mean more features and cultures can become a part of eHRAF. That's it for the video tutorial on citing HRAF. We hope this tutorial was helpful for you. Check out our other tutorials and stay in the loop or contact us by checking out our homepage and linking up with us on Facebook and Twitter.